So today, as we gather together, our hearts are overjoyed with thanksgiving and appreciation for God's graces and blessings. And we pray for Kate and John as they begin their married life this day as husband and wife. Feels like another life. Here's my love letter. You did. I pray we forever know the joy of each other's love and the joy of the Lord's love, which makes all love, all the love possible. I pray the Lord grant you the patience and forgiveness needed to love me as I continue to work towards being the best man I can be. I pray that if your will be so, that you may grant us the privilege of parenthood and the privilege of many years together, full of laughs, lessons, love, and joy in you. I thank you, Lord, with all that I have for bringing Kate into my life and for all blessings that have come our way over the past year. John is, John is the best friend that, that anyone could ask for. Um, he's the most disciplined and hardworking person I know. Uh, anyone here that knows John knows he's got his real job and then he's got his uh, vigilante job at night being a paramedic, uh, working more hours, volunteer as a paramedic than he works during the day, which is, which is crazy. Uh, he's just, just always there always wants to help anyone and everyone. Um, he's, he's really just the best friend that anyone could ask for. In knowing Kate for my whole life, I can say that she is one of the most generous and giving people that I've ever met. Kate is someone who makes other people feel welcome. I'm so grateful and blessed to have you as my sister. Love is heartfelt. It's full of compassion, full of kindness, humility, patience, gentleness. It's all of the fundamental stuff that a happy, solid marriage is all about. And faith in Jesus Christ gives that to this couple. And when you love in the way Jesus calls us to love, that love endures, it perseveres, and lasts forever. Kate and John, know of our love and our sense of awe in how you love one another and how you said yes to God's plan for you. Know of our love, treasure this day, this moment, because you're surrounded by so much love and we think so highly of you both. May God continue to guide you, bless you and fortify you today and all the days of your life. And I introduce to you for the very first time the very newly married Mr. and Mrs. John Goodschmidt. John, we welcome you to our family with open arms, all of our love and all of our joy. And can you do this? Thank you for being my little big sister and my friend. And I love you so much. Uh, for about a year and a half, every single day, uh, John and Kate pray together every night, whether it's together in person or over the phone or over FaceTime. What an amazing bedrock uh, for you guys today uh, to form this covenant with God and with each other on. Uh, I, I think it's, it's really special. So in our society, you often hear it said that at a wedding, a father is giving away his daughter. And I got to tell you, I really don't believe that. But really what today's about, I'm not losing a daughter, I'm gaining a son. And I couldn't be happier to know that John, I can now call him my son. I